hand it over to Daniel for the introduction. Well, Tyler Owen, for title. And first. Now in the suburbs of Atlanta, GA. He weighs in tonight at 175 pounds. He is your reigning and defending Mega Pro Champion. Here is the gift, Jason competitors here ready to give their all whoever wins this one is going to go home with both of the belts and both of the championships for the respective promotions as with all grand championship title matches here at international combat sports this will be a two out of three falls match Two out of three falls uh, format for the championship is to make sure there are no flukes and the championship is determined by the greatest competitor in the match. That's definitely something to uh, remember because it means international combat sports is definitely different the way this main event or title matches are decided. Well, you know, John, historically, that is how uh, the world championship matches uh, for older promotions like the NWA and the AWA were determined. Uh, they were always decided in a two out of three falls match just to ensure there was no question who the better competitor was. So, you know, from a historical perspective, it's something more of a time honored tradition. Absolutely. A little bit of technical wrestling here between the between Bouquet and Darkstorm to start to match off. Looking to be evenly matched so far. One thing to note about a title for title match, um, sometimes uh, they end with some kind of discrepancy or some kind of weird thing happening, but that won't happen tonight because of the best two out of three falls format. Exactly. Now, of course, there are no variations. If there is a, uh, let's say, a double count out, then, of course, that will be uh, a draw, regardless. Or if there is a, uh, if there is a knockout, then that is an automatic victory for the person that uh, knocks out their opponent. That's definitely something to keep in mind as uh, the match progresses, but hopefully uh, we won't have any, uh, any scenarios that play out uh, in this match with either individual that could cause the match to be in question. And that is some great athletic talent. By Jason the gift and pay. You just hop out of that scissor lock that Darkstrom had and walked out to the crowd. Yeah, congratulate himself for a good performance. Wow. 
one thing about Jason the Infant King is uh, about a month or two, he went three months ago, he changed up his appearance, he's, he shaved his beard, he cut his hair, and now he's, he, he's got a little bit different look than he's had in the last, uh, say, uh, five or ten years. Pretty much, yeah, pretty much the majority of his career, he's had that long hair and the long beard, and uh, now he's also got that uh, tattoo covering the entire top of his head. Looks to be an uh, Indian inspired tattoo. Jason okay, so going back to the outside. Not very happy, it seems. Stepping back into the ring. We did a little bit of a shoot match here. A little shoot wrestling. Ooh! Oh, slaps in the chest. Oh, blatant slap! Back and forth. Oh, gets one of himself. And another. Very impressive. You know, I'm almost having trouble following this match. They're moving so fast, John. They're good, great spinning out of control. <laughs> Dark Sun is just everywhere right there a moment ago. You know, watching these guys sometimes, I'm at a loss for words, almost get lost and just want to sit back and watch. I, I, I know we have a job here to do, but uh, sometimes it can be mesmerizing when you see two top athletes like this doing their best. I'm not even sure if the crowd knows who the roots were or not. Well, they're both fan favorites for their respective companies, so that's, that's understandable. You got about half the crowd going for Dark Storm and half going for King Kate. Yeah, I've heard, I've heard uh, various chants for both of them so far. Hey, moving the rain stairs. Dark Storm's gonna go to the outside over the top, and no, oh, he's oh, got it. He's hung up at the top rope. He came with a quick pin. Oh my goodness! He goes up one on Eric Dark Storm, and you know what that means, Kyle? If he gets the next pin, that's gonna be all she wrote. He's gonna go home with both belts. Yeah, but that means that means Dark Storm and. If I check my clock here, he came and got that in about five minutes, so that is pretty fresh here in the match. Off to an early start, start. indeed, yes. I Meaning Darshom has to battle back. He has to win two. That's right. Um, both ICS and Mega Pro Jimmy. The referee is giving the 30 second count. Now they're ready to go again. After that initial pin, uh, they will be given a 30 second rest period to maintain the composure and get back into the match. Solid uppercut from Kincaid. And just a quick note, even though you did not hear a bell, the timekeeper is keeping score over at the timekeeping desk. You know, Kincaid has so many variations of moves and names for moves, I almost lose track of everything. Well, I know right after uh, that lockup, he did a drop kick off the ropes, and now he went from that into this, this I think it's a head scissor lock on, on Dark Storm, and it's wearing him down. And I'm, I agree with you uh, on that statement of there's so many moves, you sometimes don't know what to say. 
Well, I know that one time I watched a highlight reel of Jason Kincaid that had his top 20 moves, and I didn't recognize the name of any of those moves from ever being performed by any other wrestler. He has a very unique offensive style. Well, um, we're naked choke from Kincaid. Not many to duplicate it. A win, a many, any, ooh. Jawbreaker from Kincaid. Well, I'm, I'm enjoying this match and trying not to ramble on here, but Jason Kincaid driving the foot into Eric Darby's from the stomach there. Just oh, the back break, trying to continue the damage, so maybe he can maybe get another pinfall and become uh, a dual champion here. Yeah, go ahead and wrap it up, take them both on home, back to the house. Grabbing his own foot for leverage. Nothing illegal about that. You have to take into account how tough Eric Darkstrom is, or he would have given up on that. Absolutely. He got, got, a, got a victory over Congo Kong at the last event, and then went on to beat Mr. Graham in the finals. Jason Kincaid may be slightly frustrated that Eric Darkstrom didn't give up. Yes, understandably so. Oh. Stomp to the sternum. Kincaid yelling at Eric Darkstrom to give up. You can hear him all across the arena here. Solid forearms to Kincaid. Kick to the gut, that'll stop that. Crossbody from Darkstorm. Just a two count. Can do better than that. Oh. Once again, Kincaid's up on one. So that puts Darkstorm in jeopardy right now. Every move, every, every, Calculated maneuver that Jason Kincaid puts on Eric Darkstorm, puts him in jeopardy. Oh, raking the boot across to Eric Darkstorm's face. Of losing this match. You know, John, normally these two competitors have great respect for each other, but it looks like they're going all oh, out tonight. Yeah. Jason Kincaid. Jason Kincaid get a drink there. And yeah, take a refresh one. A little refreshment. Yeah. Trying to put a little bit of skin off of uh, Eric Darkstone's face with those boots. Oh, there's no question about that. And now he's got him tied up in the center of the ring with a. a, a Chin lock and a leg scissors combination, which I, oh, I'm surprised Darkstorm is still in this, because that looks like, oh my goodness. He's got nowhere to go, no. he can't reach a rope, he can't even move. He's got to do something quick or this is going to be over fast. Come on, Darkstorm. got to do something. Well, getting back into this, the crowd might be a factor. Okay, we're moving, we're doing something here. We're not laying on our backs. Dark Storm. Dark Storm getting up with Kincaid on his back. Powering out. Oh, and into the oh. corner. That's how you end that. He fired up, but Dark Sun fires right back. Woo! Oh, 
solid knife edge chopper wow. corner. Excuse me for wooing, but that was one of the classic knife edge chops there. Absolutely. Solid forearms to Jason Kincaid. Oh, what a boring forearm! Back to Darkstorm. Knocked the living tar out of Darkstorm. Oh, now a kick! Kick to the face. Oh, the punishment. How's Darkstorm standing? I don't know, but he's doing better than I would. That's for sure. Oh! Kick to the gut. Suplex didn't quite have it there. Play Lariat. Tackle. I think they're strong. Eric Darkstorm might be going to go for his bread and butter here. The corner step up into Gurry. He's calling for it. There's the roll. Oh, no, good water. No. Not gonna happen. Belly to belly. Cover. Oh. Not enough. Not enough yet. Two and seven eighths. Dark Storm is having a hell of a time dealing with Jason Kincaid tonight. for that suplex just doesn't seem to have the power in him right now. The fireman's carry. Dark Storm powering out. Oh, went for the super kick. He got the backhand though. And the super kick connects. Oh, so close. I think that was another 2.99 there. I don't think you could have slid a piece of paper underneath of it. Jason Kincaid's shoulders there, John. Eric Darts from hitting his face, trying to get himself fired up. Uh oh. Bumper. Planted it. Face buster. And a kick out. Well, take a little bit more than that, Jason. I'm surprised how much damage Eric Darkstorm has taken from Jason Kincaid in this match. And he still knows how tough and how much passion he has to win this match here tonight. He's Still in it. It's Jason, unbelievable. Jason Kincaid giving a shout out to the late great Scotty McKeever. Oh, another roaring elbow, but from Eric Darkstorm. An Irish cross backbreaker into a flat water, and now a Cross face. Oh, Jason Kincaid taps. We have, as the announcer says, he announces that Eric Darkstrom has went up one. So we now have a time match. Eric Darkstrom has won. And Jason Kincaid has won. Whenever he gets the next pinfall, goes home with all the glory, John. Pinfall or submission? Yes. Because you just saw Jason Kincaid submit? Yes. Well, here at International Combat Sports, in this scenario, we're going to count a submission as a pinfall. So 
the match. Once again, it's tied up one more in the rest of the period. For both. With 30 seconds before the match will restart. Referee is keeping count of that. I think they're about ready to go. I guess they're ready to go. Oh! Okay, goes into the corner. There's Darkstorm over the top rope, and he's down. Darkstorm saying he's going up. Okay, laying there like a dead fish. Wait a minute, he's playing possum. Sit out oh. power bomb. Oh, oh, oh. Enough. oh wait a minute. Wait, 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 no, no. <laughs> Dark storm, that's it. That's it. No! What? No way. How did Eric Darkstorm kick out of that solid pile drive? Eric Darkstorm is human. I don't believe that. I have not seen a pile driver hit that smooth and clean since Jerry Lawler in his heyday, John. That's that's saying a lot. That's saying a mouthful. Absolutely. Okay, going to go up top, trying to finish this off. Oh, and he missed. Oh! Oh, he didn't miss that one, though. Connected him in the corner. Oh, the there it is. Gary. There That's it is. The motor. This has got to be it, John. He's just going to make that pin. It looks like he is wore out. I'm going to be after all that I've been through. Absolutely. Look, he used this last bit of energy to do that in Zaguri. Referee's counting. If there's a double count out, then it's just going to be, that's it. It's going to dig it home. They're both going to take their titles back. A dark storm for the pin. Oh! Still not enough. Hesitated just a little bit too long. I think if he would have got over there one second earlier, he would have had it. at all. Another, nothing. It's fire, Jason decayed up. Oh, that's it. That's it I right there. The and Eric Darkstorm is the champion. He hit a C4 exploder in the middle of the ring to beat Jason the Gift Kincaid. And Eric Darkstorm is going to go home with all the glory tonight. He's got the Mega Heavyweight title and the ICS Grand Championship. This also makes Eric Darkstorm a two-time Mega Pro Heavyweight Champion as he held it earlier this year. Yes. Right. Will Hawk to be defeated. Eric Darkstorm. That's right, he did. The current AIWF World Heavyweight Wait. Champion. Wait a minute. Oh. Jason grabbing the belt from Darkstorm. Well, what's he think he's going to do with that, John? He already lost the match. So, the Mega Pro Championship back away from Eric Darkstorm. What is this? He can take it all he wants, but he's not the champion anymore. Eric Darkstorm is the champion. Looks like he's trying to get Darkstorm to come back into the ring here. I'm not sure what's going on if he's trying to challenge him again. 
I'm not sure if the AIWF or the people in the office are going to sanction that, John. If that's, uh, if that's his intentions, I would, I would hope that he would just accept the feet and go home. It would be a great rematch for the trainer. Wait, wait. Oh, wait a minute. Oh! Pure sign of respect from Jason Kincaid. Oh, the ultimate sign of respect by Jason Kincaid. He's actually snapping up the belt, championship belt on the Air Shark Storm and leaving the ring to him. Well, wait, he's got, what's he got there? He's got the gun. He's, oh, he's got the ICS title as well. And he calls him the best in West Virginia. How about that, folks? That right there, John. Sums it up. That is high, high courtesy and a high level of sportsmanship shown by Jason Absolutely.